What up, what up? This is my first and hopefully not only shot at Dan Issel. I have been sucking at this fucking game. So I'm really, really praying that I get this Galaxy Opal. And I never start on this side, so please hook me up. Please. Bless me. Yes, yes, yes. This is my second Galaxy Opal ever. Yes, thank you. After having a miserable fucking day on this game, blessed. Oh, and it is the daily. Okay, anyways. So he does fall into second on my list. We'll take a quick look, even though you've probably seen him on a million other videos. But you know what? This is a first for me, so I don't even care. Jesus, he's got some hockey teeth. Hockey player teeth. So 99, 97. Definitely undersized, that is for sure. For probably both positions, actually. So we're definitely looking at... More defensive orientated. Definitely. And thank goodness he comes with gold clamps. So he's definitely not special. A little bit of three point. Works with all proficiencies. So he's definitely a dunker rather than an alley -ooper. Or sorry, than a layup. So, I mean, the stats don't stick out and blow you away. For being undersized, you wish you would be a lot faster. But you know what I say? A free card is a free card, and I will take it. But yeah, he straight up has hockey player teeth. A.K.A. no front teeth. At any rate, if I end up getting another Opal from some of the free events even though I'm really close to getting one from token market I will put some of these guys on display I think what a lot of the YouTube guys do wrong is when they evaluate players they try to feature them in all sets so of course you're gonna score 75 fucking points with this player if all you're doing is shooting with only them so if you put them in with a bunch of equal level players if they can stand up from there, then I would consider them a good player. If they don't, then they just get shuffled into the, the mix with every other player. So, I mean, they talk about how certain players are super amazing. And then they disappear in, like, team fucking games. So, if I do do some gameplay, which I guess, if you guys want that, I can later on. But, uh... Yeah, I'll try to do it the proper way instead of just featuring a certain person and then trying to score a million points with them. But you know what? I'm happy. It's over with. I'm done with Triple Threat Online for the week. Super frustrating. I almost threw my controller through the fucking wall last game. And then what did I get? The board with the Galaxy Opal. So, bless. It's time for me to go to bed. And uh, thanks for your support, everyone.